how to, how do you feel? I mean, obviously, it's nice to be back on the ice with the guys, and it's obviously been a while. And uh, you know, even if it wasn't the hardest practice in the world, it was still a good thing to do, and it, it gave me some uh, uh, some uh, perspective on where I am right now. Now you say it wasn't a hard practice, but you looked really comfortable out there, cutting, turning, no problem. Yeah, I mean, that's that's where I am right now. I mean, I try to do what I can, and I try to make it feel as normal as possible, even though it's not uh, not exactly where I want it to be. But uh, at least it's good to be out there and. and Receive some passes and, and, and give some uh, some good hard passes. What, what limitations do you feel that are, right now you have as far as the coming back? No, I mean obviously it's only been I don't know nine weeks or so, and and uh, uh, we expected it to take uh, a lot 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 more time. And, and right now it's just about uh, getting that normal normal feeling back, being in the skates and skating around and, and getting the timing and stuff back. And, and uh, you know we kind of still take it day to day. Um, pretty good. I'm not sweating that bad. I mean, obviously, I I haven't uh, been able to do uh, uh, do a lot of uh, lower body work for 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 a period of time. But I think uh, ever since I've been able to uh, to walk frequently and, and stuff like that, I've been I've been trying to keep in shape. And, and you know, uh, even if I don't come back and play, it's it's uh, it's still good to uh, to uh, be in good condition going into the summer training. Is there a timeline? Do you, do you anticipate? No, anything? there's there's not a timeline right now. I don't think anyone uh, expects anything more than uh, uh, try and skate as much as possible and, and uh, try and get that uh, normal feeling back in uh, in my leg. And, and you know, just uh, the more I skate, the, the better I'm hopefully going to feel. And, and uh, you know, when when the time comes, it's uh, it's probably going to be a, a decision that's going to be made uh, the same day. Did you feel good just to skate with other guys rather than skating on your own? Area? Yeah, I mean, obviously, obviously, when you when you skate alone, you uh, you do your drills and you do your stuff and you take your shots, but uh, you can't really put your finger on if it's really good or really bad. And and I think uh, skating with the guys is going to help me uh, figure out where I am right now. And and uh, you know, uh, just going to try and be out there with them and, and stay out of the way and and uh, uh, see how I feel after after a week or so. Good, more of it, more a good measuring stick than anything. Else. Yeah, I mean, obviously, uh, obviously, it's nice to be back. Uh, you know, it's it's uh, playoff is, is is coming, and, and you know, it's it's an exciting time of year, and, and you know, you want to be around the guys and be a part of the team, and, and you know, um, just being able to skate with the guys is gonna gonna help you get uh, that feeling back, and, and you know, hopefully that uh, that will help my recovery. No, I mean, hopefully as as much as I can, as much as we practice. I mean, I'm going to try and be out there. Uh, it saves me from uh, waking up 7 a.m. every morning, and and you know, it's nice to uh, to be able to, uh, you know, just be in team drills and, and uh, as I said, just take some shots at uh, the goals we have and, and uh, you know, see all the guys out there. How is tough has it been to, to to watch this team and be sitting on the sideline? Actually, not that tough. I mean, we've been playing really well, and and you know we've been winning games, and we play each and every day, and, and you know it keeps you keeps you busy, and it keeps you in the game still, and and uh, you know I couldn't couldn't have wished for anything else. I think uh, where we're at right now is 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 terrific, and and I think we're we're still improving, and hopefully we uh, we can find a groove going forward. There. Is it about confidence too? I mean, obviously, when when you've been away for a while, it's uh, it almost feels like summer for me. You know, you, you haven't been on the ice for a long time, and and. Uh, you know, I haven't haven't been able to do uh, all the normal stuff. Obviously, it's it's nice to be back and and just uh, just to be able to see some situations and and uh, you know um, getting some hard passes and and uh, skating without thinking. Is there any kind of target for you at all to return to game action? No, I mean obviously, uh, I think every injured player wants to get back as as quick as possible. But I mean, I'm not gonna. I'm not going to put myself in a situation where where I don't feel comfortable, and, and I'm not going to jeopardize anything of going into next season. And uh, I'm not going to take any stupid decisions. And I don't think anyone uh, working working around me either is going to going to give me any bad advice. And, and you know, we're just going to going to have to wait and see really how it feels here going forward and practicing with the team. One of the things Brian Murray said about getting you on the ice for whatever length of time the team is to maybe provide some energy or a little bit of a spark. Did you sense that when you stepped on the ice? No, I mean obviously it's uh, it's nice to be back for me, but I mean uh, you've been away for such a long time. I mean uh, you meet the guys all the time, but it's obviously a different feeling when when you talk on the ice and when you skate around together. And, and you know obviously whatever I can do to help and be a part of the team is is uh, it's hopefully going to help. Did you expect the recovery to come along this quick? Did you look back at, like you said, nine weeks ago where you were there and where you are today? Are you all surprised? Or? No, I mean, uh, I think uh, early, early in my injury, it was tough to say really how it was going to go, and, and you know, I couldn't really do much. But I think uh, 
last couple of weeks it's been uh, progressing every day and, and you know even though it's it's very small things it's it still feels better and more normal and and you know everything is starting to to work more and uh, uh, you know there's, there's tough that's why it's so tough to set a timetable because I don't think anyone's uh, been around this this type of injury before either so it's it's uh, it's just going to be a day to day and, and as long as I keep feeling better and not worse it's it's a good thing no I mean it's it's tough to say um, exactly how good I feel and, and not I mean obviously I I don't feel like I used to um, and, uh, and you know, as long as I don't get any pain or anything like that, or any setbacks, and, and uh, if I wake up tomorrow and it feels as it did today, or even better, it's 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 a good sign, and it, it shows that I can keep doing what I'm doing and just push forward. I'm no NHL defenseman, as you're aware, but, and so I can't judge on you on the ice and how good you look. But how do you feel when you're able to do stuff? Like, do you think you're I don't know how close you are? But no, I mean, obviously, it's it's tough to say, but uh, one thing is going to be go down in the corners and get the pucks and have a guy on you, and, and you know. Just those uh, those small movements that uh, that get you out of the way every once in a while, and, and you know, and just the timing of it all. I think that's that's going to be the key. And, and uh, you know, the more I practice and the more drills I do, and I will have a better sense of, of how I really feel. And, and today was just the first day, so um, felt pretty good, uh, you know, being out there and, and, and moving pretty well. But obviously, it doesn't feel like it used to. Is, is there any nerves when you plant and you know go off the right or, to, or off the left to try to make cuts or anything? Or no, I mean. Um, I don't. I don't have any pain or anything like that, which is good. And uh, you know, obviously, it's not uh, uh, connecting as as well as I want to, and, and I might not be uh, as fast as I as I want to either. And, and, and that's something that I'm gonna gonna have to work with. And maybe you know, maybe change the game a little bit for for the for the start here when I start playing. If it's this year or next year, you know, uh, it's probably gonna be a while before I before I feel 100% again. Was this day more mentally? A boost than it was maybe a physical one. I think so. I mean, obviously, uh, uh, it's it's nice to be back with the team and, and you know being able to participate in in the practice is, is something that's uh, uh, been a while since I did. So obviously, it feels feels really good just to be out there and, and uh, you know even if uh, even if it wasn't the hardest practice in the world, it's still uh, it's still uh, a nice boost for the for the what do you call it mentally whatever you know. Is it fun to chirp? I, yeah, I, I did see you a couple of times. Yeah, you know, open. it's it's uh, it's nice to uh, to be able to go out there and just uh, everything is like normal, you know, uh, you know, just to get that feeling back that uh, you know you think you missed uh, a whole lot, but you really haven't haven't missed that much, and you know, it's it's nice to just uh, be able to step right in, and then everything feels like it used to. There's been so much talk about Brian saying Murray saying you should, you know maybe on the ice in a week or so to practice with the team and McLean said that too and Melnick's in the stands today. Did you all feel pressured to get on the ice and skate with the guys? No, I don't think so. I think uh, I actually said that I wanted to practice today because I felt pretty good. I skated before for the team pictures and and uh, it felt pretty good and, and I just wanted to go out there and try and, and Gans was staying off so we had 18 men and, and I wasn't going to be in the way or anything like that and and you know it's just uh, it's just. Uh, Nice to uh, to finally be able to uh, to participate again. Will you be every day now? I mean, hopefully not game days. Maybe uh, maybe I'll skate in the morning. I don't know, but uh, for now we're just going to take it day by day. And, and if I don't feel good one day, I might not skate. Fans are going to be pretty happy to see this footage tonight. Uh, what, what do you guys say to them? No, I mean obviously it's uh, it's been a it's been a while uh, since I since I've been on the ice with the team, and, and you know all you guys are here here watching and and. Uh, Obviously, hopefully, it will be a boost for the for the fans as well. You know, to see some progression going, and, and it's been pretty quiet for for a couple of months now. So, um, you know, it's nice to uh, nice to see some people in the stands. Have you heard of this anti Mad Cook uh, fan campaign? <sighs> no, I have not. I mean, uh, that's something that uh, they're going to have to stand for. Okay. Thanks. Thanks, Eric.